so as far as the bifurcation goes the main thing from my perspective and from the congress party's perspective is that when this bifurcation took place certain commitments were made to the people of andhra pradesh and we believe that those are fundamental commitments and they are commitments made by the indian union to the people of andhra pradesh and we think those commitments should be fulfilled so that is our single most important observation that those commitments that were made that includes punavaram that includes special status those should be fulfilled sir as far as the congress party is concerned we have had a tremendous response uh, to our yatra in fact a lot of our leaders are quite surprised at the enthusiasm and the response we have had and i think this is a very good starting point to build the congress party in andhra pradesh thank you thank you sir rashtra vibhajan tarvata amaravati rajdhani ga undi prastha prabhutvam mudu rajdhani pratvaristundi congress party stand enti okay my stand my i have now started to understand a bit of telugu my stand on the amaravati issue is very clear Finally, let me answer now. Next step will be answering in Telugu. First step is answering your question. Now, uh, we do not think that the idea of having three capitals is a sensible, efficient idea. We think that Andhra Pradesh should have one capital, and we think that capital should be Amravati. That is our position. We also don't. We. i met yesterday the people who have given the land for the capital and who have been cheated and we i would like to reiterate here that we stand by those people and we will defend the rights of those people if possible then what's what's very interesting to me and this is a question i keep asking myself but i don't get an answer everybody asks the question about elections to congress party and i am proud that the congress party has had a open transparent election why is nobody interested in elections in other parties why does nobody ask the question why isn't there an election in the bjp why isn't there an election uh, in the other regional parties nobody seems to be interested in this question